Overnight gas prices continue to climb and show no sign of coming down anytime soon. AAA says a gallon of unleaded has gone up 87 cents just since January. Prices like this make pain at the pump feel like an understatement, but there is one group offering up a money-saving solution. New at 6, Eyewitness News reporter Nicola Stefan has the story in East Providence with the Providence Mobile Newsroom. We found gas prices in Rhode Island ranging anywhere from 350 to 450 today. It's that kind of pinch at the pump that's prompting the state Sierra Club to push for clean cars. Pain at the pump. Almost 80. It's not hard to find. To fill the tank is about between 75 and 80 dollars. Wallet busting prices continue to rise across the state. I think the government, the federal government, should do something about it. And so does the Sierra Club. This is a huge issue, not just for our, our own pocketbooks, but for our national security. Abel Collins with the Rhode Island chapter tells us the solution is more fuel-efficient vehicles. There's big savings to be had, and, and it's doable. Collins says the group is lobbying the president to require new trucks and cars meet a 60-mile-per-gallon standard. He says a new standard could save the average Rhode Island driver $474 in a single summer. That's based on gas prices at $3.99 a gallon, and that adds up to more than $200 million in savings statewide. Those we spoke with tell us it's a great idea, but the thought of buying a new car... It's too expensive right now. I you can expect to see a major rollout of plug-in vehicles in showrooms beginning next year. In the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Nicole Estefan, Eyewitness News.